Ito na naman yung segment na gusto ko. Meron tayong bisita, Balik Bayan, all the way from USA. Ma'am, anong pangalan niyo po, ma'am? My name is Sandy Andrada. I'm from Jacksonville, Florida with my husband, Al Andrada, retired U.S. Navy. Astig, ma'am. Mayamang kayo, ang dami niyong alas. Anong sabahan niyo po, ma'am? I'm Ambassador of Bank of America and also other bank institute. And I used to have my small business in Florida. And I'm here just to see you, Mr. Tulpo. You know, I'm very proud of you. Everyone in around the world, especially myself as well, I would like to meet you in person. Honestly, last week I was here. We just here in, in Cavite because just to give a special respect for my late mother. She was 90 years old. I I really appreciate everything you do for everybody here in the Philippines and also around the world. Alam mo, para kang doktor. Kulang na lang mag-surgery ka, you know that? Ano ma'am? Kayo naman sir, kumusta naman kayo? Mabuti. Working in Navy Housing in Mayport. He's the manager in Navy. So double compensation dun sa pension plus? Yes. Mayaman kayo sir? Hindi naman. Ano bang kotse niyo sir kung pwede malaman? Lexus lang sir. Lang! Lexus! Lang! Well, we used to have 10 cars, but right now, because it's too much for us to take care of. 10 cars? What kind of cars, example? Uh, palagay mo na ng uh, Armada, Lex. Armada? Yeah. Yung Nissan? Yeah. Ang mahal nun. Okay. And I do have a uh, Sport uh, Mitsubishi. Wow! And then I also have a Honda. And Mr. Tupo, probably you'll be able to give me a Mercedes-Benz house, that sounds. <laughs> oh, Mercedes, no, that I cannot afford. But you have Mercedes-Benz at one point in time. Uh, before, yes, but I like Lexus right now. Lexus is better than Mercedes-Benz because Japanese-made car. How about BMW? Uh, yes, in Europe, we do have that. How about Porsche? Wala, hindi ko kaya yun. <laughs> Jaguar. Sa'yo na lang galing. <laughs> Yan siya sabi ko palagi mga Pilipino sa Amerika masisipag at siempre yung kanilang kasipagan nilawardan nila sa pamagitan ng pagbili ng mga bagay-bagay na gusto nila kaya sa Amerika pag masipag ka na bibili mo lahat. In your name, ma'am? Shirley sure, Dimaranan po from Bacoor. Eh sila ba may mga binibigay na pasalubo sa inyo? Yan lang sir. Oh coach? Yan MK. MK. Ilang lang? Ilang lang ni ma'am? Oh. Kinaman mo ni Heather. Oh pati ito pa. Oh coach? Coach lang yan sir. Coach lang? Ano ma'am? Wala yan, sir. Ano lang yan, kumbaga, parang uh, simple lang yan doon. Pero... Small token. Simple yeah. lang. Sir, do you mind, can I give a shout out in Florida? Of course. Mami Mati, maraming salamat po for everything. Also, Kabiti Association, Blessed Trinity, Fika. You know, sir, when I was driving last time here, nagtatanong lang ako sa isang MTPB. Ang pangalan niya, Eddie Feralta, kasi po I got lost. And okay. it's my first time to drive again here in the Philippines for about 30 years. Tapos po, tinulungan niya ako away to here. He's not even asking me for anything talaga po tinulungan niya. It's good. And also, thank you, Mr. Moreno. Ang ganda po ng ginawa niyo sa Manila. So, ma'am, kailan kayo nagpunta ng U.S.? Early 90s po. Eh, bata pa kayo noon. Dalagita pa siguro kayo noon. Yes, I'm 51 years old now. You don't look 50, you look like late 30s. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Estudyante pa kayo noon dito? Yeah, I was born and raised here in Philippines. Bakor, Kabite. Kaya naman, sir? I was immigrated in 1984 in the U.S., in New Jersey. And then when I finished my high school over there, I joined the Navy. Kumusta naman po yung buhay natin sa Amerika, lalo pat si Donald Trump yung presidente, ano pong pinagkaiba sa mga ibang presidente? Yung mga benefits ng mga veteran, sometimes kinakalta sa minsan, and it's hard. So we need to work more. Pero ang kagandahan po, katulad sa inyo, retired sa U.S. Navy. Ikompleto kayo sa benefits, medical, dental, tama? Tricare is the best, and also we do have Medicare as well over there. On top of that, si ma'am meron din. Yes, yes, I have her. Retirement as well. So, boy, Harry, kayo rin na doon. Honestly, Mr. Sofa, we're just very humble kasi marami rin po kami tinutulungan, mga kaibigan back here in Philippines, mga hindi namin kakilala. So, I send them, you know, gifts, balikbayang box, kung sino po yung mga nangangailangan. Talagang, we share our blessing. Yun po yung sinasabi nila, share your blessings, yun yung kagandahan sa ating mga kababayan doon sa Amerika. Marami sa kanila nagsisikap, nagtsatsaga, na magtrabaho at hindi na may mili at kapag nakapag-ipon, nag-invest sila ng mga properties, mga pera sa bangko and then on top of that sila nagpapadal ng pera din sa ating bansa. So ma'am, meron kang mensahe sa mga kababayan natin na gustong yung mamang katulad mo rin, gusto magsapalaran sa Amerika at maging katulad niyo one of these days. Sure, simple lang po ang dapat po natin gawin. Manalig po tayo sa poong may kapal and always be humble no matter what we achieve in life, kung saan muna po tayo nakarating sa iba-ibang sulok ng mundo, kailangan nakatouch pa rin po ang put natin sa floor at huwag po tayong makalimot kung saan po tayo nanggaling. 
Thank you. Missy Sharma. Thank you. Uh, napapanood ka ni Missy sa YouTube and I uh, was, oh, what you watching? So, I watched with her and then I was, wow, you know, I will love your show. Beautiful people, mga kapatid, yan yung sinasabi ko palagi. Mga kababayan natin, OFW Balikbayan, pagkain na pa siya sa Pilipinas, come visit us and we'll treat you as VIP to lang ginagawa namin sa kanila. At sumasaludo po ako sa inyong dalawa, sir. Madam, at siyempre si Ma'am. Thank you din po kay Sandy at kay Kuya Al sa lahat ng mga kabuti nila para sa amin. Yun lang po. Short and sweet. Okay, salamat din po sa pagpunta.